troubleshoot and repair guide. First, replace the parts and test. Charging flex cable water damage might cost no service for a while and no seem for a while problem. Troubleshoot it accordingly by replacing the charging dock flex cable and see if the problem solved. Second, troubleshoot the baseband power supply. Measure the diode resistance of the baseband power supply and see if the readings are normal. If the readings show abnormal, troubleshoot the related components on the circuit. If these three circuits lines C5702RF, C5702RF, C5630RF are measured abnormal, it's mostly due to the baseband CPU damage, which is unrepairable. Third, Replace the XCVR1RF and XCVROF. Replace the intermediate frequency ICXCVR1RF and radio frequency ICXCVROF and see if the problem solved. Fourth, troubleshoot and replace the related chips on the SUAT1RF circuit line. The chips that can be easily water damaged and fail are LBLNRF, UATCPRF, and MHBLNRF. Fifth, troubleshoot and replace all the chips connected to RFFE mainline. The chips that are connected to RFFE mainline are UATCPRF. LATCPRF, GSMPARF, MHBDSMRF, LBDSMRF, MBHBPARF, LBPARF, QPOETRF. Welcome to contact us for more repair training via info at hcqs.com.cm If you are interested in learning more repair skills and methods, we provide course for iPhone repair training, MacBook repair training, and broken screen refurbished training. Comments and questions are always welcome below.